tips and advice from thought leaders from around the globe that will guide you to the next destination in your career. And now, your host, Katrina Brittingham. Hello, hello, hello. You are with Katrina Brittingham, your navigator on your road to success. I am here today speaking to you about building a legacy. And how do you build a legacy? By creating passive income. And it is possible by building an IPA or income producing asset. We all have residual bills that come in month after month with no end date in sight. That is our electric bill, our cable bill, our internet bill, insurance, and the list goes on and on. Many people agree that it is possible for the rich and talented to create passive income that continues after the work is done. Some examples would be an author of a best-selling book or a writer of a hit song or a wealthy real estate investor. These people get paid again and again for the work they did once. For most people, the question is, can any person do it without special talents, or lots of money. Well, we have our special guest expert, Murray Miller, the co-founder of the Global Exec Team, who will talk to you about how you can do that. And I'm just going to give a little bit about Murray. And so his bio reads, Developing multiple streams of passive income is not just a dream. Having built both online and traditional businesses successfully, Murray understands the nuances to balancing a well-timed business venture with your current endeavors in a manner that breathes life into both. A passive income is the lifeblood of financial freedom. If you're curious about how you can realize substantial passive income, reach out to Murray and he will schedule a candid conversation with you. If you both determine that you are a good fit, then you'll take the next step and he'll show you exactly how to put this to work for you. And so without further ado, hello, Murray. Hello, hello. Well, thank you, Katrina. What a nice introduction that was. <laughs> You are very welcome. Thank you, and welcome to the show. Thank you very much. Can um, you oh, go ahead? Go ahead. I was just going to say, uh, if you want, wanted me to give just a little bit more background, I could do that. But if you have a question, go right ahead. Well, I was going to ask you about uh, the background, and I was going to ask because uh, this build, uh, ooh, I can't speak. This show <laughs> is about building success and successful businesses that thrive and produce the income that you were talking about, the passive income. And so, can you give us a little bit of history about yourself and how you came into your current business? Yes, excellent. Well, thank you so much. Great setup for me. Um, you know, I'm calling in right now from Boston, Massachusetts, and it's um, interesting because the business that we're going to speak about tonight can literally be built anywhere. Um, you don't need a traditional setup like a bricks and mortar establishment like I've had in the past. Uh, mm-hmm. So my background, I've been an entrepreneur my entire adult life. Um, most recently, uh, for the last 20 years, I was running a financial services company. I specialized in the area of college funding, so I was working with high school parents, uh, helping them navigate uh, you know, how they were going to send their kids to college, how they were going to pay for it, what was the best way to borrow if they had to borrow. And with that, um, not only was I working directly with high schools and with parents, but I eventually grew the business to a national company with over 100 financial advisors that I had trained on how to use our methodology in order to best, most tax efficiently fund a college education. Along with that, I started a nonprofit organization called the American Scholastic Foundation, which we we did a lot of uh, work helping under uh, privileged students and students that didn't have the means to go to college through scholarship programs that we had set up. That was an extremely rewarding business for me, and also it was it was lucrative, it was profitable. Um, and frankly, for 20 years, I loved what I did. 
Mm-hmm. One thing that I found as I started to get older and into my 50s is that I was still working myself 50, 60, and sometimes more hours per week. I traveled a lot. I was entertaining a, a lot of the advisors that we had brought on board. I did a lot of training. Um, and over that period of time, I collected about 25 employees, several different locations. I had overhead. I had rent. I had insurance. I had, of course, payroll, uh, you know, accounting, legal, all the things that go along with traditional business. And that can wear on you after a period of time. Mm-hmm. And when there is a downturn in the economy, um, you know, your bills don't get any smaller. They, As you talked about in the beginning with the residual bills, well, it happens with mo- most small businesses as well. They just continue to build and build and build. And if you don't have the revenue because there's a downturn in the market for whatever reason or something shifts, those things still exist, and then you find yourself having those ebbs and flows that naturally take place in business that make it very difficult to uh, enjoy what you're doing because you're you're no longer concentrating on the thing that dro- drove the business to begin with, helping families go to college. In my particular scenario, it was more how am I going to feed this beast every single week, every single month, every single year that I've mm-hmm. created with over 100 advisors and 25 employees. So it did, honestly, if I'm if I'm being completely transparent and vulnerable, it did wear on me, and mm-hmm. it kept me up at night sometimes. It, w- it was mm-hmm. stressful. Um, in the meantime, and we were just talking about this offline before you started the show, um, you know, I gained weight. You know, we talk about gaining weight. It happens when you're mm-hmm. when you're stressed, when you're on the road, uh, when you're entertaining, and you know, when you're not getting yourself to the to the gym, and you're not eating properly, and you're starving, and you're just grabbing something quick. And over a period of time, I started gaining weight. I didn't like what I was seeing in the mirror. And right. my wife uh, had had raised our two children. Uh, one's off. Uh, you know, on her own now, and she's an entrepreneur and building a business, and my youngest is uh, is in college right now, and she decided she wanted to go back to work and started working with a nutrition and wellness company, and she said, Murray, she said, try the products. Use the products that I'm, I'm representing. They will absolutely change your energy. They'll change your life, and like you, I had an amazing experience on these products where all of a sudden – out of nowhere, the weight started falling off me, and mm-hmm. I started feeling vibrant again, and I was back in the gym, and I was not falling asleep on the couch right after I ate. It was just a whole different thing started happening, and I, I, you know, I looked at what she was doing, and I said to myself, if we can create a global distribution for this product that I'm absolutely obsessed with, we can build mm-hmm. a tremendous business. And, you know, uh, to, to explain what happened, and, 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 you know, I'll give you the end of the story before the, the middle of it. The end of the story is I ended up over a two-year period of time preparing myself to exit my companies that I had started 20 years ago. It took a while to find the right partners and to, and to wind myself out of what I was doing so that it wasn't the Murray show, that it didn't all depend on me, that everyone wasn't coming to me for all the answers. And I I put other people in place to take care of that. I found the right partner to eventually buy my equity from the company, and I was able to make an exit from that traditional business into this online franchise, if you will, of, of this nutrition and wellness business that I'm in now. And it really comes down to, in order to build this and be successful, and like you said, without having huge investments of capital or other forms of, uh, you know, barriers of entry that come in place, whether it's, uh, you know, the, you know your, your um, background or your, your history or any of those things, it comes down to this. It comes down to one consistent activity of building a consumer network in now 14 different markets that this company does business with. Uh, Mm -hmm. Perhaps this example could resonate with most people. It's similar to everyone's heard of Amazon, of course. Amazon's taken over or changed our retail world forever in the way that we shop. So if Amazon were to pay a referral fee to help people open up an Amazon Prime account, so if I told you, Katrina, hey, have you heard of Amazon? You said, yeah, I heard of it. I said, well, you should set up an account. They have this great program. You can go online on your phone or on a laptop 
anywhere you want. You can you can buy just about anything that you need, and it gets drop shipped to your door. And just by me introducing it to you, Amazon Prime, in my example, would pay me a fee for doing their marketing for them. And mm -hmm. every time that person, or let's say you, Katrina, every time you ordered from Amazon, they would send me a small little piece of your purchase, maybe you know two percent, four percent, something like that, as a thank you for bringing them a new customer. And right. not only would they pay me for you coming on, but they would also pay me for anyone that you shared this information with. And when I saw this model, and you know they, this is going back you know fifty, sixty years, it started with Avon and Amway. And that was it was kind of like they were drop shipping products to your garage or basement. We had to stockpile them and have people come get them. This was completely hands off. So people mm -hmm. would set up their own account. They would have it on their phone. Whenever they needed to order something, they would press a couple of buttons. They'd order it at a 25% discount because they were part of the membership. There was no fee. Like Amazon Prime charges a membership, there's no fee in this to become a member. But anytime you need your products, and you're changing from what you're currently buying to this dense nutrition product and getting a result with it, they would send a check to the person that introduced you to it. That right. is how this works. That is exactly how it works. So anyone can go from you know, just earning an in income based on their own personal production and their own personal professional expertise to be able to leverage themselves and create that residual income that goes on with or without their efforts after it's been built up over a period of time. Does, it, does that make sense? Absolutely. Yeah. So um, I, I wonder if your listeners um, are familiar with Robert Kiyosaki. He's one of the, the greatest uh, uh, financial minds, uh, I think, that people will say, you know, best-selling author. He talked about, uh, I guess his best-selling, most famous book was Rich Dad, Poor Dad when he talked about uh, how to leverage real estate so that you can build a residual income from that. Well, some people know this, and, but most people don't. And he went on to write several other books. One of them was called The Cash Flow Quadrant, which I'm going to speak about for just a second, and the other one was called uh, The Business of the 21st Century, where he actually talked about this industry that, that I'm referring to today called network marketing. A lot of people are familiar with it, and they think they know what it is, but they're not really sure. But in Rob Kiyosaki's um, book, The Cash Flow Quadrant, he explained that in your mind's eye, if you could just be looking at a piece of paper and you draw a line down the middle of the piece of paper and then a line across, so you'd see that there is uh, you know, four squares basically on this piece of paper. On the left-hand side, he in the, on the top quadrant, he drew an E, and that stood for employees. And underneath that, on the left-hand side, on the bottom, he drew an S or self-employed. And what he said was that 95% of the population was on the left-hand side of the quadrant. They were either employees or they were self-employed. Mm -hmm. But only 5% of the wealth in the entire country and around the world is on that left-hand side of the quadrant. On the right-hand side of the quadrant, on the top right, he drew a B that stood for big business, like a you know a Microsoft or you know an Apple or a company like that. And on the bottom side, he drew an I, and that stood for investments. And those are for people mm -hmm. like you know that have a huge amount of cash that their investments are earning so much that they're they're not necessarily working every day for their money. Their money's working for them. And he right. said the right hand side of the quadrant literally had 95 percent of the wealth but only 5% of the population. Mm -hmm. And in his book, he said that most people can never go from the left-hand side of the quadrant to the right-hand side of the quadrant because they're too busy making a living to be able to create a future that has leverage in it and creates residual income. He goes on to say that network marketing is one of the few industries that he has ever seen where an average person who's not that author you talked about writing a book or not that songwriter or, or artist or, or athlete or entertainer or someone who's got high special talents that gets paid a lot of money for what they do without having those special talents or the money to invest in real estate or have a huge business like Microsoft or Apple you can do it through network marketing because you're leveraging people as opposed to money. 
Everybody mm-hmm. in the network marketing industry has the opportunity to purchase products directly from the company at a wholesale price on products that they would be using anyway, but now they're buying from their own store instead of someone else's store, and at mm-hmm. the same time they're able to build a business because as they introduce people and those people introduce people and so on and so forth, you start to create a network. Now, th- this part, is it still blows my mind to even talk about it, but my wife and I started in the business with just the two of us using the product, shared it with a few people, and over the last seven or eight years that we've been involved with this, and I'm only, I'm only full-time for the last year and a half. I, I was part-time the whole time in the beginning. But over that period of time, we've introduced probably around 200, maybe 210 people to the business. And those 210 people, I checked online tonight, just I went in the back office of my account just to see how many people that turned into. It's, it's turned into 14 different markets that we do business in where we have people that are using our product that are part of our team, and the number of people is 110,650 people at this point. Which is mm. mind blowing. I, every time I see this, it's like pinch me because obviously I don't know 110,000 people. Those people came into our network over a period of time, over a number of years, and now we receive a small little piece of every single product. And by the way, there's hundreds of thousands of dollars worth of products being ordered every single week, and this company drops, uh, uh, you know, a, a check in our bank every Monday morning for all that product that is off, uh, um, being ordered from around the world. It's mind-blowing. Wow. That, and, it, and it is. It definitely is. And I, I just wanted to just um, take a little moment to review what you said, because you, you said a mouthful of things. Um, and one thing as an entrepreneur and as a business coach to entrepreneurs and small business owners, we mm-hmm. all can sympathize with the 50 to 60 hours a week or more traveling, um, not take, taking care of yourself properly. Um, my mm-hmm. audience knows that, you know, basically I'm going to come back from uh, working a whole lot of hours, stressing myself out, and ending up in critical care. <laughs> and so oh. I realized I had to make a change. Like it was literally life and death that I had to make a change yeah. uh, because That's working drastic. that way and stressing yourself out, I, it just takes a toll on your body. And same as like you said, I, I loved what I did. So it wasn't like, oh, well, this work was, you know, so draining to me. I mean, there are people who, you know, they go into work and they hate it every day. I loved what mm-hmm. I did. Um, mm-hmm. But, you know, just being on that wheel and having the ebbs and flows and, like you said, when there's a downturn in the economy, your bills are still there. And when you're a business owner, you have your personal bills and then you have the business bills, and they all still mm-hmm. have to get paid. <laughs> That's right. That's right. No, you're, you're absolutely right. Well, and so, I, I will tell you. Go ahead. I, I was just going to say, and so uh, doing what you did, uh, speaking to you um, when we met, it really stood out to me, and I was like, okay, I have to get this person on the air because <laughs> I know that a lot of my audience – needs to hear this and how to make that passive income because that's the question that I get. How do you get passive income? And so mm-hmm. you uh, being on the show is, is a big thing for uh, the listeners and also myself. I have my ears opening listening. <laughs> yeah, no, it's, it's awesome, Katrina, because honestly, um, I pinch myself every morning when I wake up and I say this is, I, I am blessed and I'm very, very grateful uh, having had this opportunity to participate with this particular company, the company is Isogenics. Um, they are a 17, almost 18-year-old company. Uh, they started in 2002. Um, they've done over seven billion dollars in cumulative sales without one ounce of advertising. And I'm very, very proud of the team that we have. We have helped. Ten people at this point earn seven figures, million-dollar earners. We have literally dozens and dozens of people that are six-figure earners. We have calls that we do every single morning at 8 o'clock in the morning that we have a different subject every single day. For example, on Mondays, we're talking about setting up your week and we're recognizing the past week of people that have advanced in the, in the system 
Tuesdays we talk about product, Wednesdays we talk about connecting, Thursdays we have a rising leader call, and Friday we do compensation. And we have all of our different leaders, 10 different leaders that, that take a week with their, with their team that talk about this, so we support them. And then we have events twice a year, big events where people can come out and meet. We have a social gathering. So we have a support system that we have set up for these independent entrepreneurs so they can participate in the business on a part-time basis. 99.9% .9 of people that are involved in this, this is a side hustle. Not, people aren't quitting what they're doing. Believe me, I, I had a, like I said, I loved what I did too. I had a great income from that. You know, the, we know the downsizes, and, you know, you had a much more dramatic <laughs> uh, situation than I did with, with your health. But it was taking a toll on my health, and, it wa and I wasn't living the quality life that I wanted to live. So I had to make that change myself. And these products, I feel like, have saved a lot of people's lives, and I don't mean that literally because they're not a medical company and we don't, you know, cure anything or, or make any claims to do anything like that. We're just really good nutrition. The body's the miracle. But if you put these protein shakes in your body and you use the vitamins and, and you use the snacks and you, and you replace some meals with some of these high-quality protein meals that we have, it can make such a huge difference. And then, of course, it's hard not to have people notice and ask you, what are you doing? <laughs> you know, you, mm -hmm. you've lost a lot of weight. People are going to ask you, how are you doing it? What are you doing? And if you have something that you can point to, a system that works, that has, you know, an 18-year track record and all types of health studies and science behind it. And, you know, we have 50-something scientists now that work directly for the company. We, we don't outsource this. So we do all our own research and development. And we continue to improve on our products as new technology, new science, and things come around. A lot of our product line is plant-based, and it tastes delicious, and people love it. They get very hooked on it, and that helps you create that residual income because you're not coaxing, you're not selling anyone anything. Once they use the product, they decide to click on the button on their phone and order for the next month or go on to an auto ship program, which is helping you build a legacy. Isogenics mm. allows us not only to earn the money, but it also allows us when we decide not to work anymore to continue to receive that money. I can only imagine what it would be like if you walked into your boss at a traditional job and said, hey, I've been working and doing this for eight years. I don't want to do it anymore, but I'd really like you to continue to pay me. <laughs> right. Most, most bosses would laugh you out of the office. And it gets even better than that because when you pass – this is something that is uh, it, it's something that's generational. It's literally going to be passed on to your heirs, whoever mm -hmm. you want to leave it to. So the the as long as people are in your team and they're ordering for themselves and that income is being generated, they continue to pay that. This is a legacy company that plans on being here a hundred plus years. It's a family built uh, business that is debt free, that is doing amazing things on this planet. Um, and the more you peel back the onion on isogenics, the, the, the better it gets. The markets they're playing in and the, uh, the the quality of the products and the people, the integrity behind the company, it's just really, really exciting that we can build a business alongside this huge corporation and they allow us to be independent and take on none of the financial risk but have all of the upside potential. And that's awesome. That That is definitely awesome. Uh, that uh, you have this uh, stream of income, this passive income um, that will last for for years to come and that you can leave mm -hmm. this legacy to your children um, mm -hmm. and their children. Um, because yeah. even, you know, because you're making this money, um, even if, say, you know, and I'm, I'm not speaking anything bad, but just, let's just say that, you know, Isogenics does decide, you know, to um, not exist anymore. You, you've made this income that you have, um, you know, amassed that you can save, that you can invest um, in other mm -hmm. things. So, you know, you can definitely have something that comes in that, like you said, you set up this one time, um, you mm -hmm. can grow it, you have people um, that you're bringing in, and off of each purchase, you're bringing in income. And that mm -hmm. is the goal, or should be mm -hmm. the goal, of every entrepreneur out there, to have a product mm -hmm. that they can bring in income um, constantly um, and everything, and they don't have to necessarily put 
all of the effort in, and it gives them the freedom to do the things that they need to do. And I I, before we continue, we are going to be going to break in about a minute. So I'm going to have Murray say what he needs to say, and then we're going to go to break for 60 seconds, and then we're going to come yeah. back. Perfect. Yeah, so I'll just say you brought up a really good point, you know, and if, if, if something like that were to happen, um, the skill set that you build in network marketing is transferable to any company. Um, you know, I have, I, have, I have chosen Isogenics because I believe they're a generational company and their, their hearts are in the right place. They're, they put their money where their mouth is and their science is solid. So that's why I've chosen to park my car here with these guys. But, um, you know, the, the skill set that you learn and the relationship relationships that you build are yours to keep you know they're not going anywhere it's it's a great way to uh to end to go to the segment now when we come back i'll talk about the market disruptors and how that can be transferred over into an income stream regardless of where you are and that is awesome and with that we will be going to a quick break and we will be back in 60 seconds certified award-winning resume writing or career coaching service to help build your professional brand and help you get hired faster then you need VentureReady.net. let the professional staff guide you step by step to land you your perfect dream job why go anyplace else we've helped many people just like you develop a strategy to help you succeed that's VentureReady.net. let us convince you by calling 1-888-712-4956 that's VentureReady.net. the complete package Package for any career path you take. All right, that was Venture Ready LLC, and that is the career services portion of the business that helps businesses and people who are in transition move into business. And also, if you are an executive and you're not trying to go into business but you want to move further in your career, we help you with that as well. So if you want to reach out to us, you can reach out to us at info at VentureReady.net or 888-712-4956. And we are back with our guest expert, Murray Miller, who is talking to us about building a legacy by creating income-producing assets. And so we're going to be picking up uh, with Murray. And actually, I have not even gotten into the questions (laughs) um, (laughs) that uh, I was to be asking. So let's get into the questions. (laughs) Okay. (laughs) How can someone build a secondary income while working full-time? Great question. Um, As I mentioned earlier in the show, 99% of people that are involved with us are part-time because their, you know, their full-time business is whatever it is that they do. And this is something that they can do on the side as their side hustle to build a, you know, a secondary income stream. And I think that just carving out a little bit of time in the pockets of your life, whether you are a busy mom uh, that has a, you know, that goes to work and only has spare time, you know, very limited spare time, or you're a business owner or you're a corporate executive and you're traveling. What I suggest to people is they find those little pockets of time and that's when they do the deliberate efforts of building their business. I only spent, you know, just being completely frank, maybe four to six hours a week when I first started because I just didn't have any more time. I was, like I, like I said, I was running a financial services company. I had a college planning company. I had a software company that we had built in order to house all the information for our clients and show them how to do college planning. I was uh, sitting on the board of a nonprofit that I started. I didn't have any extra time. So to me, time was an extremely valuable commodity. And so when I spent my 15 or 30 minutes working on building my isogenics team, that's what I was laser focused on, and mm-hmm. it does take focus. I mean, it's not going to happen overnight, and it's it's going to take some focus on your part. Nothing happens uh, by accident. You're going to have to make it happen. That's right. And well, anything worth having is going to take work, and it's going to take um, some some hard work and some dedication to do. Um, but the mm-hmm. the return on the investment is so great with your time, like you said, with your energy, with your the income that you're coming in with. Um, so with that being said, do you need any special talent or investment money to be successful? 
you do not, which is which is very refreshing. So there there are no barriers to entry. Anyone who wants to become a customer can open up a membership account at no cost. Um, they can go online and order whatever it is that they feel that they need. There's there's a hundred products in the Isogenics line that are in a variety of different categories, including performance for people that are uh, weekend warriors or athletes that want to take their performance to the next level. There's a line for energy for people that are lacking energy, uh, which is one of our uh, biggest categories. We have a, a line for healthy weight loss, um, which we have literally hundreds, no, thousands and thousands of physical transformations. You can see the pictures on our websites. They're absolutely incredible. And then we have a line for healthy aging. So literally, our categories are, you know, in the multiple billions of dollars. Energy is 121 billion. Weight loss is 15, almost 16 billion right now. Performance is 30 billion. Healthy aging is 90 billion. These are huge and growing markets. They're not, uh, you know, uh, we're not in an industry that is flat or, or declining. It's, it's actually growth because our population is aging and people are looking for these products. So that makes a huge difference. The only talent you really need is to be able to share information with people and everything is on websites and, and there's links that you can send to people and you can, you know, let them do their own research and watch, uh, you know, the little vignette videos that we have. And people that are looking for help, that are looking for building something on the side to create that, that uh, secondary income, that additional retirement income, or if they want to just earn enough income to get their own products paid for. Whatever their goals are, it's available here without special talents because everything is already set up for us. It's, it's, a, it's a turnkey system, if you will. I think that the easiest way to describe this, when, I, when we went to break, I was going to talk about market disruptors. What I mean by that is companies like Apple that interrupted and disrupted the way that we communicate and changed everything forever. Everyone's got an iPhone or a smartphone to some extent, and you can call anywhere for free, and you can do video calling and, and so on and so forth, and social media. That's changed everything. Google mm -hmm. changed the way we gain information. It's just, you know, we Google everything now. We used to have encyclopedias. Uh, if you, my kids don't even know what encyclopedias are. We talked about right. Amazon today. We used them as an example. It, that, that company completely changed the way we shop. In my opinion, Isogenics is changing the way people think about getting their nutrition, and it changes the way people think about how they can earn income. It's providing a better way. That's a market disruptor. And Isogenics is on the leading edge, going through amazing growth right now. You know, at, at a billion dollars, where the probably – one of the most unheard of companies on the planet that's doing that kind of sales because we are basically, we don't advertise. You'll never find isogenics on the radio. You'll never find them uh, on, a, you know, on a billboard or in a magazine or on TV or any of that stuff. It's, all, it's just all done through word of mouth. So no, the answer is you don't need a special talent with isogenics. You just need a little bit of drive and a, a reason why. I mean, we call it your why that you know, why are you involved? Why is it is it for health? Is it for wealth? Whatever that the case may be, you can make it happen. And that's awesome. So, you know, for those who might be a little um, scared of 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 sales and selling, like if you have, and that that's one thing I learned that if you have your why and you have your story as to why you're doing what you're doing, it will pretty much sell itself. You just need to get in front of the people to talk about it. I couldn't agree with you more, and it's funny because what we found is the most successful people that come involved with our company are not salespeople because salespeople sell. And isogenics is not something that needs to be sold. It's something that needs to be shared. That sounds a little hokey, I know, but what I, what I mean by that is if you get a good result on a product, you kind of want to tell people about it. It's kind of natural that we do that when we feel something that's good that we want to share with people that we love. And if you don't get weird and you don't get awkward about it, it's not selling. It's simply letting people know what you're doing. And some people will just ask you, you know, what is it that you're doing? You look like, you know, you look different or you have more energy or whatever the, whatever's going on. People notice that. And, you know, um, there's, there's just so many techniques and strategies to share this in a very casual way that is non-salesy. -sales, 
where people can just, like I said, set up their own membership account, get a 25% discount off the retail by having their own wholesale membership, and then order products directly. It's just that simple, like, like you would if you were buying from Amazon. And that's, that's awesome. Like, I like that, that because you're right. Like, if someone loves the product, it goes both ways. If someone hates your product, they're going to tell anybody. <laughs> if someone loves your product, they are going to share it, and they're going to love the fact that they are sharing it. And it becomes, you know, more of a, look, this, this product did this for me. It will work for you. And so yep. that, is, um, that is marketing in itself. You know, and I, mm-hmm. you know, did a um, a show on a TV show about um, social media marketing, and it's funny that you brought up um, Apple and Amazon and um, Google. Number because number one, they were not the first of their kind. Mm. They just revolutionized what they did, and they had a differentiator, and like you said, a market disruptor, and mm-hmm. they took everything by storm and actually pretty much ran everybody else who was doing it before them out of business um, because right. they came up with this market disruptor. Because um, even the term, oh, I'm going to Google it, that's Google's name. Pretty much you're using the search engine to do a search. But nobody says, oh, I'm going to search the search engine. They're saying I'm going to Google it. <laughs> you know, it's funny that you say that because I remember when we were kids, when we when we used to have to blow our nose, we would ask for a Kleenex. Mm-hmm. I thought that Kleenex was actually tissue. I didn't know until later on I recognized that tissue was the actual product, but Kleenex was the brand. But yes. we just thought we were it was in our head that Kleenex was tissue because they did that. And the same thing like you just described with Google. It's just you 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 and I believe it it's gonna be isogenics when people start thinking about ways to make money and build a residual income and to get healthy they're going to think of isogenics because isogenics is they have a a movement that they've created. Their goal is to become the most trusted and well-respected health and wellness company in the world. That is their that is their driving goal. And the way they they do that is not by becoming the biggest, but becoming the best at what they do, and that's what they've been driving home since they started this company 18 years ago. Yes, and 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 it's it's funny because I'm not going to go naming brands, but um, <laughs> but mm-hmm. we do that a lot. Uh, what we use to to bandage our finger with, most people mm-hmm. will say, "I need," hmm, and that's actually mm-hmm. a brand name. It's not actually yeah. <laughs> it's not right. actually the product. And so right. you know that, and and that's when you can do that and have a product that people will call the name of your product. Your brand and for that product, yeah. you're now you're a household name, yeah. and so that's where, um, like you said, you want isogenics to go. That's where all of our entrepreneurs and small business owners um, want to go and want to be. Where you're, when when people think of whatever it is that you do, they think of your brand name, not the actual mm-hmm. like you know. I mean, of course, you, the products are important, but when that becomes people's go-to phrase, you know Mm -hmm. you you have really stumbled onto something, you know, and you know that it's going to be great and big. (laughs) You you know, you remind me of something that I'm reading a book right now. I'm about three-quarters of the way through it. It's a new book written by uh, Simon Sinek, who's written some great books. One of his better ones was The Golden Circle that he talks about. But this new book Mm -hmm. is called The Infinite Game. And the infinite game, basically, what he talks about in this book, which I know you'll love, Katrina. If you haven't heard of this, you should definitely pick it up. He talks about the difference between companies that are playing the short game. You lose, I win. And that Mm -hmm. is how they're, they're playing the game. They're not playing it for the long term. But companies that are in it for the long term, what he calls playing the infinite game, they don't. They know there's going to be ebbs and flows. They know there's going to be other companies that come around that may have a better product than them at one period of time or another. They know that they're going to lose people that that were once part of the company. They understand that is human nature. That is how it works. But in the end, 
if you have the long-term outlook, if your goals are that, to build a legacy-based company, you will go long-term, and all of those other players that have to win or lose will go away. He even likens it to what's happening in our country and in other countries around the world in our political environment, where it's now set up that you're either a winner or you're a loser. You're either on this side or you're on that side, and how mm -hmm. that never ends up serving everyone. It mm -hmm. always has to be, there has to be a center where people can come together and feel like they're on the same team and, the, and have the same cause. And that's what makes things go long term as opposed to there has to be a winner and a loser. And it's just terrific. The, the stories that he uses and the companies that he quotes that have done this over a period of time, even governments that he's, he's shown that have fallen because they were on the wrong side of that equation. So, yeah, it's, it's a great book, and, and I feel like reading it, I'm thinking to myself, man, he could have been talking about isogenics in this, <laughs> in this book because this mm -hmm. is a company that absolutely has a very long-term mindset. They don't even think in terms of years or decades. They think in terms of, you know, the next 50 years, what their plans are. So it's just, it's just brilliant when you're with someone, uh, you know, with, with a group of people, our management team, I would put up against any Fortune 100 company in the world, really, because they do have that mindset. Like I said, the, the skills that you build in network marketing are transferable to any company, but I've chosen to hang my hat with Isagenics because of the growth, what they're going through, their long-term vision for the future and where they want to go and uh, how they treat their competitors, which is brilliant. They, don't, they, they never put down other companies and say we're better than these guys. They just continue mm -hmm. to do what they do best, which is right. awesome to be a part of. And, and it is. And you know what? And the best and the biggest – Never do. Because you know why? Because they're busy building their empire. Mm -hmm. <laughs> when you're busy building Absolutely. your empire, you don't have time to talk about any other company, what they're doing, what they're not doing, because you're busy working. Um, and you're yes. busy uh, getting that to that goal. I, I, I love the name of that book. And I, I, for some reason, I think I have heard of it, but I'm going to look it up and I'm going to take another read. <laughs> yeah, it's it's it's, not, it's it's his newest book. It hasn't been out very long, and uh, I think it's gaining it it's gaining momentum right now. You can even get it on audiobook if you prefer to listen as opposed to read. But it's a uh, it's awesome. Yes, I, I definitely am going to get that. But I know because we're actually you know almost at the top of the hour. So can you tell our audience how to get started? in isogenics if this is an option yes. that they want to go into? Yes. I, I would say um, being, on, being on a team that you feel like you can, you know, fit into the tribe, fit into the community, become a part of a positive, uh, you know, environment, um, reach out to me. I'm happy to, you know, share with you the information and let you make a decision for yourself. Um, you know, my email address is Murray. My name is Murray, M-U-R-R-A-Y, at Get, G-E-T, Free Global, GetFreeGlobal.com. And um, if you send me an email, say, hey, Murray, I'm interested in getting started, I'll show you how you can go online, set up a wholesale account at no cost, and then I'll, sh I'll walk you through some of the different products that they have, and you can decide what it is that you want. And then you order some products for yourself, and you're in the system. And once you're in the system, you can decide from that point if you want to just continue as a customer, which is more than 80% of our, our enrollees are just customers. They don't do the business itself of building a team. Or if you decide, hey, I, you show me how I can earn my products for free, I can show you how to do that. Or if you decide, hey, I want to make a part-time income or even a full-time income, there's a plan that we can put you on to get you there. We, we've been doing this for a long time. Like I said, we've got a lot of success stories on our team, and we, we would love the opportunity to work with anyone that is a positive person and is, is, is willing to put in some time to make a difference in their own future. Awesome. So you have the option of having the benefit of the products and using them to strengthen your health or meet your fitness goals. Um, or your health goals or your diet goals, or you can mm -hmm. become a part of the organization itself while you're using the product <laughs> because yeah, the best right. advertisers for the product will be people who are using it and have yeah. transformed their lives with it. So you have that's those right. options. 
That's exactly right, Katrina. <laughs> so uh, do you have any other advice for our entrepreneurs who may be listening tonight? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, I think the lifeblood of any entrepreneur is having a passive income stream, whether it is that, you know, Isogenics doesn't have to be your final resting place as far as your last career. There's many other things that you can do, whether it's investments or, you know, real estate or, um, you know, giving back to charities, uh, you know, whatever drives you. I think the income from Isogenics can help you get to a, a level that will help you. Um, and to me, having a side gig and having something that, you know, there, there's a lot of side hustles today. Let's face it, there's Uber drivers, there's, you know, Airbnbs, and, you know, those are great companies. I mean, who would have thought just, you know, five or ten years ago that the biggest taxi cab company in the world would be a company that owns no cars? Right. <laughs> and who would have thought that the biggest real estate company in the world would be a company that owns no hotels, right? Right. Or it's just it's just crazy. So I think that um, the thinking just being shifted a little bit on what is possible that you can do in your part time, you know, if you can carve out those four to six hours a week to get started and start to see a result and maybe get your product paid for to begin with and then start building a part time income and eventually something that can be really exciting. I mean, I'm talking about really exciting. I don't like to talk about the money too much because it's all based on personal effort, but there are people in our company, over 300 of them, that are what we call isogenics millionaires, 330 now, that have earned millions of dollars with this company. So anything is possible if, you, if you're willing to put in the time and the effort and the work. And like I said, no big investments like, uh, like a traditional business. It's just a matter of putting your time in. That's awesome. So you have that. You have how to build a legacy, how to bring in passive income, and you can do it in the time frame that you want. So you can keep the business you have and have your passion and have your passive income coming in uh, while you're doing that, and you can be building right. wealth while you're doing what you love to do. And That's building right. that wealth and having that extra income will allow you to have the lifestyle that you want. You won't have to put in as many hours. Not saying that you don't have to work as hard, but you would have you would have more time. You could go on vacation with your children. You can save for college. You can build your dream home just by having your passive income. All of the above, Katrina. And again, it's Murray M U R R A Y at GetFreeGlobal.com. I'm on LinkedIn. It's Murray Miller. I'm on Twitter. It's at Murray J Miller. And I'm on Facebook, Murray Miller. Any, any, you can find me. <laughs> if you look for me, <laughs> you'll find me um, as the co-founder of the Global Exec Team. And I'd love to uh, to take you on a tour of what it is that we do. Katrina, I do appreciate the time you've given me. I know you do a great job. I've heard your show many times, and it's it's excellent. And I'm just excited awesome. that I could be a guest for you tonight. Awesome. I, I thank you for coming. I, you you definitely uh, piqued my interest. You definitely piqued my interest in many ways. You gave me some homework with <laughs> with the book mm -hmm. um, that mm -hmm. um, uh, the Infinite Game, and mm -hmm. I am definitely going to look that book up. I am actually on the Isogenics website right now, and cool. like you said, they have you know a product for you. They have the weight loss line, they have the performance line, the vitality and well-being. So you may not have any weight loss goals. You might not need performance because you're not an athlete, but just the vitality and well-being. You know, I, I would speak to people all the time who are in good health and maybe they just need that boost um, of mm -hmm. energy to get those vitamins and minerals that they need, and mm -hmm. they have a product for you. They have ISA Kids. Um, so they have something for you. They have essential oils. They even mm -hmm. have personal care and beauty. Um, so yeah. you can go into those different areas and find out what you need. Um, I'm definitely just taking a look, um, you know, for, for the yeah, vitality and well-being piece. <laughs> it's good that you said that. And um, whether or not people decide, if you, if you do decide to try some products, and, and I'm saying this to you, Katrina, and to anyone else, Always get in touch with the people that introduced you to it because, mm -hmm. first of all, don't buy it off of uh, eBay or Amazon, even though the prices are the same. 
because they don't give you the 30-day money-back guarantee, which is only you get if, if you start your own membership. Okay. And if you call the company directly, you become what is called an orphan, an orphan account, which means you don't have mm. anyone to support you. And I, and I talked about all that support. Literally, you want someone like me to sponsor you into the company because that way you have a support system and a community to rely on to not only on the product but also on the business side of it. So I know we all like to Google and check out websites, but I'm just, I don't want you to make the mistake of going and doing it directly when you need to go through a person in order to get on someone's team so you're part of a community. I totally understand that. <laughs> so you, you heard that. You want to have that support. Uh, you want to have the team behind you. I, I, I do Google everything just because I wanted to see um, – <laughs> Me too. The product. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> and there we are again. I think it's just, I think <laughs> Googling. <laughs> when we're talking to someone, we're Googling whatever they say at the same time. Yes, yes. And and it is an awesome it's an awesome product. I'm I'm looking at the things that are available. Um and I I went there simply because I wanted to let people know um that, you know, there are products for whoever you are, because sometimes people think, oh, I'm not losing weight, this isn't something for me, or this isn't something that I can um, sponsor because I don't need to lose any weight. And so, right. you know, I wanted right. people to know that whether you want need to lose weight or uh, whether you don't need to lose weight, yes. Um, yes. there's something there for you. There's something yes. that you can uh, sign off on. There's something that you can. There's um, there's some products on there that you're already using from some other company. But if you were part of this, you would be supporting yourself in your own store, as opposed to like you said. There's there's personal care. There's skin care. There's there's performance for athletic people. There's energy products. There's you know is and of course the weight loss, which is a huge category for a lot of people in our country. We all need to you know keep our weight under control. So there's many different lines of products for, that people can relate to. Yes, and, and, and that's what I like because, you, you know, you have people who just want the health and beauty and people who actually work in health and beauty, and this could be an extension of it. Um, and you said that your products are 100% um, natural um, and yes. things like that, so that is a big seller um, for yes. uh, people. I know, like, for myself, I, I love the organic um, things um, because you have people who may have uh, different allergies. Um, so do you, with your products, you know, do you have, like, different products for people who have different allergies, different... Oh, um, well, absolutely. All, all the products are gluten-free, soy-free, GMO-free, organic. Um, you, can, you can go to isogenicshealth.net. Um, with all the clinical studies that they've done and trials. And, of course, uh, you know, if you're working with a, a, a sponsor, someone like myself, then they're going to be able to put you in the right direction and answer all your questions and at least get the information that you need because everyone has something going on that they need to know if it will work. And, of course, you know, it is only nutrition. It's not, it's not medicine. So you're not going to need a doctor's approval, but you certainly can take the information to your doctor and show them the ingredients or her the ingredients and let them decide if it's something. If you had, a, you know, for example, a heart condition or something else going on, if this product would work for you before you started. Exactly. That, that's always wise advice. Um, take the information to your doctor, um, you know, before you uh, take it. <laughs> yeah. Just to make sure that you don't have any uh, adverse reactions or um, right. interactions if you happen to be on medications or have a condition. Right. Um, so that is definitely uh, wise, sound advice. Uh, we and are, we do have we, help lines. We do have doctors on staff and nutritionists as well. But go ahead. I know we're we're running up against time here. Well, I was just about to say, we have about two minutes left. Um, so do you have um, anything else that you would like to say uh, to our audience? Um, well, listen, I'm very grateful to be able to share this information. I, I would love to answer questions for anyone uh, that, uh, you know, wants to send me an email or to uh, contact me through social media or through your show. They can, you know, you have all my contact information. Katrina, you can pass them on to me. And I'm more than happy to answer any personal questions for you. Jump on a phone call and spend a few minutes with you to make sure you get all your questions answered. Awesome sauce. And I do have uh, Murray's contact information, his social media handles 
on the actual Facebook page, um, my my personal Facebook page, as well as the Venture Ready page in which the show is, well, it's streaming both on my personal page and the Venture Ready page, but however you listen, it is there. Um, so you can uh, reach out to him and uh, speak to him and have him answer all of your questions about uh, isogenics, um, whether you want to take the product or whether you want to go into business to have that passive stream of income. He is more than willing to answer your questions. I know because I'm the questions girl. (laughs) (laughs) And he will patiently answer all of your questions um, and help have you have that passive income. I do thank you so very much um, for um, coming on the show. Uh, we are wrapping up the show because we are at the top of the hour already. And have a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful evening, everyone. Thank you very much. Good night, everyone. Career GPS. Join us next Wednesday for more insights from career experts and thought leaders from around the globe who will help you reach the next destination in your career. To be a guest on the show, contact us at info at or call us at 888 712 Ashley, I'm here. Hi, pleasure meeting you. All right, just give me give me another moment and we will um